Hello, hello. Welcome back. I'm Claire. This is Purple Poppy. And I've just jumped on this afternoon to do a quick does this help you video mainly. Um, I've been working on the heirloom journal that we, or I say we, I decided to use the cover from that ledger and cut it down. And I just want to find, I should have pinpointed exactly there we go I just want to find a certain section so I decided that I wanted to do a family tree as part of the heirloom journal because if it's heirloom you know you'd have your ancestors and such in it now first and foremost this is not my family these are photographs from a kit that I have and I was busy building my make-believe family tree. And I remembered that one of you wonderful subbies had left a comment on one of my previous videos. I've got a feeling it was the video for paper clips and safety pins. I'll have a look and try and find the comment and mention the lady in the description in the hope that it will help but obviously if it helps anyone that's fantastic and the comment was basically that they were struggling to downsize images um, on their computer so the images here these five these five here and these three here they are the actual size that they print from the kit these four here are also actual size and these are part of a freebie these four smaller ones from Artie Mays so if you want small ones and you really can't downsize pop over to Artie Mays she's got a freebie with these um, old photographs on and I'm afraid I'm sorry I can't remember what it's called but I'm sure if you pop along to her Facebook group or her website, you will be able to find them. Okay, so let's not show you too much of this because obviously that's all a work in progress to come later on. If I bring my laptop in and I'm just checking my screen to make sure that you can see, I think that's in the right position for you to see. Right, now this is just a folder on my computer that's got lots and lots of pages on. Now, this one here, if I double click it, this is another freebie from Artie Mays, okay? And that's the way that it's meant to print on an A4. It's meant to print as um, basically a quarter of a page so that would be like a postcard size about an A6 so normally we just press there and we would go to print okay and it would print it as it was designed look the four on the one A4 sheet however if we close that down and instead of double clicking it we just right click it comes up with this now, if you then press print, it comes up on the print screen. And then on the side here, you can slide down and decide what you want. So that is the one which is as it's meant to be. But if I press it here, it takes it down to half the size. And if I go here for number of pictures and I press two, it will print two on the page. I can then come down even further and I can choose to press four. So now you can see that the actual original image is a quarter of the size because instead of getting four to an A4 sheet or an office sheet, I'm actually getting 16. Now I would never go smaller than that and I believe that is the size that I used in the video. But if you really wanted to, you could come down again and go to 99 and look how tiny 
they are then. Because I'm getting nine copies of the original image. Okay, and obviously there was four. So should we do that again with a different image? So how about, how about, how about, how about this background page? Press print. See, it's a whole background page. I can now only have half a background page. Okay. Or I can press two and get two of them on the one page and so on and so forth. And one last little thing that I will show you on this, I did tell you it was going to be a quick video, is I need to find a line of images. Um, do, 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 they're all... Right. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four images here, yes? So if I put my cursor down and I highlight I missed it sorry put my cursor down and highlight all four and then press print it's automatically telling me I have got four pages worth because obviously each one is an A4 but if I then come down to the four, it's going to put all four on one page and resize them small for you. I hope that was obvious and clear. And rather than confuse you further, I've maybe helped you to resize your images. I should just say this is a standard... Um, Acer mini laptop. I believe I'm running in Windows 10, but I've been doing this on my computer for many years, way before we were using Windows 10, probably right back to six or seven, to be honest with you. Um, the only thing I would say is I don't know how this would work on a Mac. So if it's a standard computer or what I call a standard computer, then you should have no problem at all doing that. So I hope that's been helpful. Have a great Sunday afternoon. I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.